is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. This is the Tiger Financial News Network, 10 o'clock. Tiger, Tiger Financial News Network update, market update. And it is the 7th, the Friday, October. Whew, that was quite a couple of days going up and quite a couple of days coming down. We're down 456 in the Dow, 29,470. Basically filling that gap, Tuesday's gap up. Look at the S&P. Filled in the gap, down 77 at 3667. Look at the QQQ in the X100. Fill the gap, down 7 at 272.17. Look at the IWM. IWM just filled the gap. It was acting a little bit better than the others, but now it's playing catch up, down 4 at 169.70. Gold, gold pulling back Friday, down 16 at 17.04. Had a fabulous move up. Now it's testing the nine period moving average, which crossed positive over the 14. Looking at uh, the dollar, <clears throat> the dollar has actually moved up a little further. It's at 112.45, up 19 cents. The nine period did not cross negative under the 14. It's still green. It's looking good. The MACD is weak. The stochastic's very weak. But you've got prices moving higher, and that's the most important thing. Now what we're looking at is, within that context, the TLT, and this is really the story. Uh, uh, Tommy uh, Jr. was uh, looking at uh, all the yields, discussing the Fed, discussing bonds, and uh, very uh, acute and very, uh, very timely discussion in his show, The Market Kickoff, uh, starts at 9 every morning. And look at this, bonds are making a lower low, meaning that the yields are going to higher highs. This is the TNX. We'll do more of this when I get back for the target technicians. Now, nope, the yield is not broken to a new high. We're going to be watching this closely at 38.98, 3.898% on the 10-year. What we're looking at is crude oil is really moving well. It's up $1.70 at 90.16. Crude oil is acting. I'll draw a quick trend line in right now as we're going to the break. Basil Chapman, Tiger Technicians Hour coming up straight after this. And I hope you can stay. It's going to be very interesting. We've got a lot of chart patterns to look at. Be back in a moment. Check out my opening call, Daily News. 